Hey everybody, Team Ryder here, and we're doing another one of our retailer highlights. And today I'm here with Techie Sales. Uh, say hi to people. <laughs> hi, how you doing there? I'm Ray. I'm the owner. Mike. And I'm He's Michael. I'm the executive vice president. Awesome. Well, thank you guys for taking the time to sit down with us today. Thanks uh, for inviting us. No problem. Um, so we just want to talk a little bit about about you guys. So how long have you uh, been in business for? Uh, we've been in business since uh, 2006. Our uh, our baptism by fire was the very first New York Comic Con. Like we didn't we didn't start small show. We just kind of went kaboom, just jumped into the deep end of the pool, and uh, we've been uh, we've been uh, active since. Oh wow! Okay, you you did not start slow at all. You just like let's just jump right into the biggest show on on the continent. Okay, <laughs> that's right. Uh, awesome. And then, you know, what what really sparked you, uh, you know, the the reason to to start a store for you know Tokusatsu stuff? Oh uh, well, um, I I've, I've been watching Tokusatsu since I I lived in Japan, so I saw my very first Kamen Rider is the very first one, all the way back in '71. So all the years I've been collecting toys, and finally when I said, you know what, why don't I you know try to get the toys myself rather than buy from over expensive retailers? And then uh, we decided to start the business and just say, hey, listen, you know, we could get our own stuff and provide good quality customer service and good items to people. Yeah, I, um, I started watching Kamen Rider V3 in Hawaii. And growing up in Hawaii, there's a lot of Japanese culture there. So I had some of the stuff readily available. I remember going to like my local drugstore and they had the Kamen Rider line of Hot Wheels available. Uh, and it wasn't really until I left Hawaii and, you know, tokusatsu things became more difficult to find um and that just kind of spiraled into well i want to get this figure but i can't really pay 200 dollars for it um so joining miteki sales was just one of those things where it's like you help them get things from japan you meet the fans you meet the people who like you want to have things from the show and you don't have to pay exorbitant prices for it awesome and you know what kind of things can people get you know at, at you guys' store Oh, we can we we have the whole lineup of Kamen Rider stuff. We have the belts, we have the SH figures. You know, we'll, we even have like little tchotchkes, you know, little little Kamen Rider items for all kinds of price points. You know, and um, you know, it's uh, we we carry Gundam, we carry Ultraman, Godzilla. We're we're very big on Tuxatsu. We were probably uh, one of the earlier adopters of. Tokusatsu. When we first started, a lot of people didn't have Kamen Rider or Ultraman or Godzilla. Everybody was all into, you know, anime, Dragon Ball and Sailor Moon. And when we came in, we were the first people that, at least, at least, what we could see, that carried Kamen Rider. And then people were amazed that we had Super Sentai, we had Kamen Rider, Ultraman. People, people wanted this, but no one spoke up, and we yeah. just happened to have it. Right. Yeah, so we've got everything from the role play items. We've got like the old high detail figures, even the original Shochaku Henshin figures, the progenitor to the SH Figure Arts line. Uh, we even still have some Kiyomotos uh, of like Kuga and Agito, like the big, big statues. So, wow, that's awesome. Now, wh where are you guys located out of? Like, wh what part of the country are you in? Oh, we're on the East Coast. We're we're based in New York City. Uh, we don't have a physical store, but we are very active online. Oh, awesome. We also do a lot of the convention circuits. I mean, not so much yeah. now with what, what's happening. Uh, <laughs> yeah. You know, New York Comic Con, Castle Point, a few of the local conventions, everything on the East Coast we, we try to do. Um, as much as we love our online store, like really the conventions that we have um, mm -hmm. are the opportunities that we get to see people. Because really there's a lot right. of moments where you can find something online, but having someone around the corner see a booth and be like, oh my God, you know, like I you guys have the Sengoku driver. Like, Yes, we do. Like, it, there's that kind of, uh, there's that brief moment where you see, like, the recognition and someone's like, I didn't expect to find something this niche that I love here. Right. So, just meeting people like that is, uh, is an yeah. absolute joy. Yeah, meeting, meeting the customers is always the best. They come on over, they're so proud to have their belts on or whatever, and you just kind of sit there and you, you smile with them. You're just like, there you go, you know? Good right. for you. <laughs> awesome. Now, uh, we, where can people find uh, out more about Muteki online? Oh, you can find us uh, on www.mutekisales.com. That's M U 
T-E-K-I sales.com. And we're very active on Instagram. We're at Muteki underscore sales. So we're very active on Instagram and obviously on our website. And if you see us at a convention, like just start talking to us. Like if, yeah. if you get me started on Common Rider Zero One, I'm gonna I'm gonna go. Like I, <laughs> I will not shut up about that show. That's right. He'll just go. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Well, guys, you know, everyone out there, definitely please support Museki Sales. Uh, you know, we told you guys that, we, you know, you being visible has definitely helped us get more access to more things uh, from, from Bondi Japan uh, for Common Rider. And retailers like Museki Sales are part of why we're going to have this screening this weekend. This is why we're getting access to more things because also retailers like them are really helping us out by bringing the items right directly to you guys so please support them and hey when the world stops ending we'll we'll see you at a convention yeah, <laughs> oh. yeah we'll all put on the belt yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll once the apocalypse is over yeah we'll all come on over we'll all wear, <laughs> wear some belts definitely <laughs> awesome guys well thank you for taking the time to sit down with us and guys support with techie sales thank you so much thank you david see you later guys take care